guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a declutter of all of my lip pencils. I put most of my color or all of my ColourPop lippy sticks in here as well. I don't know if I'm going to include them or not, depending on how long the video is. Um, but yeah, I have way too many lip liners and I used use the same one most days. So I kind of want to just get rid of them. Some of them just are not colors that I gravitate towards. So we're just going to dump these out. I don't know why I dumped them out. But look, isn't this cute? It says, some bunny needs coffee and there's a bunny on it. Like, you guys don't know that. Anyways, also found two paper clips. I guess I'll keep them. Alright, so let's go with... I'm just going to start picking stuff up because I don't know. Alright, this is a e.l.f. Um, matte lip color. It's basically a lipstick in a pencil form. Um, it's that. It's in the shade Tea Rose. I'm going to get rid of it. It's too purple and it looks like deadly on me. Um, so that's going away. I have the Rimmel Exaggerate Lip Liner in the shade Epic. I don't know, am I going to swatch all of these too? It's that one right there. I think I'll keep it. Put it back in this guy. This Buxom one was in a recent favorites video. It's their plush, plump lip, plump line lip liner crayon a levris. Different language. It's in the shade Hush Hush. That shade right there, I really like it, so I am keeping it. Estee Edit in the buff. Also, I went through all of these and I sharpened them all today, so I'm kind of proud of myself. I was a little proactive before I started this video. Mm, I'll keep it. It's pretty. It's retractable. Oh, this is the one that I didn't don't like using because you could push it, like retract it up, but it won't come back down. I don't know why. I'm going to get rid of this for sure. Elf, another matte lip crayon, but this is in the shade Cranberry. It's just way too... Yeah, it's just not not a color that I wear, so I'm going to get rid of that. Um, let's see. Oh. Colourpop Skimpy. What is up with, like, Colourpop liners? They always do this, like, they just pop out. It's that one right there. That's kind of pretty, except that part that keeps coming out. I'll keep that. Colourpop Lip Liner in Deeper. I've actually never even used this. Brand spanking new, but I am going to keep it. Reply to a text real quick. Alright, moving on. The next thing I have is this Epsons lip liner in the shade In the Nude. Also doesn't look like I've used this, ever. That's very similar to the one before it. What is that? Skimpy? Whatever. I'm gonna keep it. It's pretty. Alright, this, um, I like the formula on these. These are the new Wet n Wild lip liners. I have, oh, that's not it. I swear, I have two of these. Yeah, I do. I have it in the shade, the pinker shade is Never Petal Down, and the berry-ish shade is Plum Together. Both of them are not my colors, so I'm going to get rid of both of them. Um, but they're basically new. That's Plum Together on the top. It's way too bright. I don't know why I thought I would like it. Like, it's literally the color of the cap. And this one is way too pink. Again, literally the color of the cap. I don't know why I bought it, but never going to use those. Okay, um, LA Girl Endless in the shade Wine. Oh man, that looks beat up. Let's see, what color is it? Oh, that's pretty. I, it looks like I've used it a couple times, but I don't know how long, like, or how well it lasts in my lip line, but I'm going to keep it. All right, Milani Spice. I love this. This is awesome. This guy right there. Keeping it. Essence Soft Berry? Nope. Satin Mauve. I also really like this one, so I'm going to keep it. It's that right there. It's kind of purpley, though. But I guess. I mean, if you layer it, it won't be as purple. I'm going to keep it. I'm not doing too well with this decluttering thing. Uh, NYX Natural? Where is it? It's this one right here. 
NYX Natural. I'm going to keep it. Rimmel Mauve Shimmer. I, I bought this the other day. Supposedly it was, it's a MAC Sore dupe. Let's find out. That is Mauve Shimmer. And this is MAC Sore. I love MAC Sore. They're totally not dupes though. Like, MAC Sore is a more red and that's more like mauvish purpley. Didn't I say like in the beginning of the video that I don't like purple? Like purple on my lips. The color purple is really nice. So I am going to keep both of them. Maxor is really, really good. If you don't own it, I think you should get it. I'm still on the hunt for a dupe because I really want a drugstore version and a cruelty-free version of that color. So we're going to go ahead and keep both of those. Um, let's see. NYX Mauve. I'm running out of space. I really like that color too. It's actually what I was wearing on my lips like nine hours ago. It, it's gone now, but that one, that one right there, or that one, one or the other. All right, e.l.f. What is this? Lip liner and blending brush. I don't think I'm going to keep this. Yeah, no, I'm not going to keep that. That's a little too pinkish peachy for me. I actually didn't even buy it. I placed an e.l.f. order once, and it just was in the box, so... That's going there. I love this e.l.f. matte lip color in the shade Praline. How much of this is left? Oh wow. For as much as I think I use this, there's a lot left. Um, I'm running out of room again. It's that guy in the middle right there. It's really pretty. I really like it. I'm going to keep it, of course. Um, ColourPop Lumiere. I bet it's going to do that thing where it's like half out of the cap. Yep, I was right. Gorgeous color. Um, I don't understand why they can't, like, secure their liners. Like, this whole stick just freaking came out. It's probably not the best thing to do to your makeup, right? Pull it out of its packaging. <laughs> oh, I don't know what's wrong with me. Also kind of, where did it go? Also kind of purplish, um, but it's really pretty. I like it. I like, um, the shade and the lippy stick also. All right. Tawny by Jordana. Also very amazing. I'm not going to get rid of money, am I? It's this shade right there. I'm keeping it. I don't know if I'm going to keep this. Plush Plum by Jordana. It doesn't really... Ooh, holy crap. That is a lot brighter than I remember. I used to wear this under, like, red lips, but... Nah, I'm not going to keep it. And then this, like, I used it the other day, and the tip came off. It's by... Real Her. It's called I Am Precious. I got it in one of those subscription box thingies. And like I was lining my lips and this guy came off. And at the time I was in a rush and I thought it was retractable so I was sitting there doing this. And then I realized even though it's plastic you can sharpen it. But I and oh funny bone. I ended up going over it with a different lip liner so I don't even remember what color it was. Oh that's pretty. It's that guy right there. So I guess I'll keep it now that I know it is sharpenable. Colourpop Aquarius. Um, how do I feel about this? Oh wow, that's a lot prettier than I expected it to be. Right there. Um, the lipstick, I think I didn't really like it when I got it because it's identical to my lip colour and it's like, what's the point of wearing a lipstick if it's just your lip colour? Like, this is my lip colour. Uh, but yeah. Milani Bordeaux. I don't think I like this. Yeah, I don't like it. Oh, it's very similar to this Jordana guy, though. I think I know who's going to get these red guys. By the way, lip liners are super easy to sanitize. You can obviously just sharpen them. Or, like, for the retractable ones, just twirl them all the way up and then um, spritz them with alcohol. I'm obviously going to sanitize them before I give them to anyone or if I throw them away. I don't think I'm going to throw them away, though, because these are, like, not used very much. So I'm probably going to sanitize them and pass them on. I'm not keeping this. Essence, wish me a rose. Um, let's see. Heck no! That's like freaking Barbie doll pink. When am I ever going to wear that? Why did I buy this? Why did I buy this? I bet like a YouTuber told me to get this, and I did. Don't listen to us YouTubers. <laughs> I'm kidding. You can listen to me, though, because I'm not getting paid by any of these people to tell you what's good and what's not. I'm just telling you because I can. Um, Starlux loves boxy charm. Charmed. I don't know. Do I like this? It looks like I've worn it. Oh, this is the one that always breaks. It's not even. There's no color. 
Why is there no color coming out? Literally, like, no color. There is no color. What is, what has happened? Oh, crap. Maybe there's color on this side? Nah, dude, no color. Alright, I guess this is actually going in the garbage. Ah, oh, fudge. BoxyCharm and Starlugs, you collaborated with these people to give me a colorless freaking lip liner? Alright, moving on. I've never used this in my life. Urban Decay Glide On Lip Pencil, it's in ozone. I think it's clear. Yep, it's clear. Um, it's supposedly supposed to make your lips lipstick last longer. I don't know. Maybe I'll try it. I guess I'll keep it until I actually try it, and then if not, I'll just give it away or throw it away. Peekaboo Neutral by NYX. I know why I bought this. I bought it because of Manny MUA. He said, or it was his go-to for a really long time. Will I ever wear it, though? I probably will, so I'm going to keep it. Even though, NYX, why can't you create retractable lip liners? Please. I hate freaking sharpening. Kat Von D Lolita. I am definitely keeping this. Definitely keeping this. It's not like the formula though. Oh, that color. It's that one right there. If I could twist my hand that way. It's not as... Why is my hand so hard to twist? <gasps> oh, it's that one right there. Um, the formula isn't as like long-lasting as people say it is, but I mean it's decent. Like 12 hours later though, it's not still there like some people say. Just putting that out there. This. Okay, I tried this the other day. First of all, I don't know how you're supposed to use this nude sticks crap on your cheek. I don't know, but we're gonna start on this the front of our hand now. Um, that is extremely beige, and it made me look like a dead person. So it's going away to whoever wants it. Two more lip liners. What time are we at? Okay, we're doing okay. Um, Rimmel East End Snob. Who told me to buy this? Nicole Youngwell Unpolished, I think? Maybe? I'm pretty sure. Oh, but why? It's so pink. I'm gonna keep it, try it on a couple of days, and then if it doesn't work out, I'll give it away. But it's practically brand new. And then my last one, also Nicole Youngwell Unpolished, Rock and Rose by Jordana. I really like this. I don't know why. Oh, bunny hair on it. Fantastic. Alright, let's see how much have I used this. See, I used it a pretty decent amount because there's not much left, but I really like this one. Um, Rock and Rose by Jordana. It's that one right there. They kind of look similar. No, that one's definitely more beigey. You know what? I'm going to take this nude sticks back, put it in my little cuppy guy, and try it out this week. Alright, I don't think I am going to include my ColourPop Lippy Sticks. I'll keep that for another video because I'm running out of space. I don't have any makeup wipes where I'm at, so we're just going to call it a night. Um, let me know what you would like to see next in my declutter series. I feel like we should all do this because, trust me, when I say makeup expires. My next video is actually going to be my empty slash expired crap. Um, and... Just a heads up, a lot of liquid lipsticks expire really, really quick. <laughs> Color pop. And like, it's it's sad because the amount of money like I spend on makeup and for it to literally just go into the trash without me using it more than twice, kind of depressing. Um, but after I like decluttered my liquid lipsticks and realized how many of them were expired, I haven't bought from ColourPop since then. So I guess it's a good thing to declutter because, you know, you kind of realize that, hey, stuff does expire, so don't buy so much unless you think you can use it. So I don't think I did too good on my lip liners. These are the only ones I'm getting rid of. But I seriously would never wear these. Like, they just, I would pick them up and be like, nope, not going to wear it. Pick it up, nope, not going to wear it. So yeah, that completes my video. I was about to put these back in my cup. I'm going to have to find a place to put this. But yeah, that completes my video. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And until next time, I will see you in my next one. Bye.